Warning, this video contains scenes of animals being dispatched in the UK using legal limit air rifles. Do not watch if you may be offended. Go and watch Charlie Bit My Finger instead. This is my FX Dreamline in 177 calibre. This is the light version using an ATN Excite 4K Pro 5 to 20 and a laser ballistics rangefinder shooting Bisley Magnums in 4.50 calibre at 11.7 .7 foot pounds. After 10 minutes of being at the permission, these two rabbits came out. So I took the first one, the other one scarpered. Quite a straightforward shot, 30 yards. Half an hour later, these three came out. Uh, picked the one I wanted, took the shot, the other two scarpered. Didn't come back for about another half an hour. So one finally pops its head out again at 20 to 7. Won't sit still as kids don't. Just trying to get it to sit still, sit still. Just won't stop and it jumps out of the way. So I'll sit there and just waiting for it to pop its head out again. No, it's just going to stick its head around that corner any second. Any second now, it's going to pop back out. Any second now, it's going to come around the corner. I know it is. Um, hang on, there it is. Oh. So, this is where it goes matrix and ducks. And it must have just timed it right. But this is the reason it ducked. An Apache helicopter going over, well it was about five of them actually, but by the time I got my phone out and filmed it, there was only one going over. But I didn't want to point my rifle at an Apache, so I've seen what happens on YouTube to people who do that. So I filmed it with my iPhone. This one ran in and sat 15 yards away. It didn't rude not to really, but there you go. It's a strange, I thought it had Mixie. Um, it was it just came running in and... Uh, stopped but it didn't it was okay it was clear so i thought i'd film the robins for a bit as nothing was out for a while safety's on the gun by the way and robins are hard to follow because they climb all over the place so then i look to my right and there's a little pair of ears sticking up on the other side of the fence so now i'm just trying to work out how i can swing the gun round quietly and carefully because this rabbit's about five yards away on the other side of the fence. So I just decide just to swing it anyway and just go for it. So uh, there we go, there it is, a little young un. And now I'm five yards away and I'm trying to work out holdovers, hold unders. Uh, well, I'll put it about there, should be about right, I think. And there we go. And I think I got it, but I'm not sure. It seemed to hit the rail, but I don't know whether it went through it or not. Um, so now I'm at the end of the evening, I've got half a dozen pellets left, so I'll have a go at this pebble, which is about 45 yards away, just to show the accuracy of the gun. Bit of hold over, because they've got the sight zeroed at 30 yards. And it's pretty straightforward to shoot this little stone. It's such an accurate rifle with these busy magnums. Uh, I prefer the heavier pellet as the uh, JSB exacts it lights as well, they're just a bit light for my liking. So there we are, three rabbits collected. The larger one's gone in the bag for uh, the crows as bait on Sunday. Thanks for watching.